tried to escape, but something broke his neck with a single strike. guy died here after several stomach wounds. Did it just twitch? Whoa, must be my nerves. Ferocious blow, and he was gone. Ah, wild beasts carried out quite the massacre in here. didn't get far.
looks of these plants, this photo was taken somewhere in South America. Mayan artifacts could be the prized jewel in many a museum collection. Is she gone? Did you get her? What the hell's going on? I'm sure I shot her dead, but then she ran. Oh, snub, we are in trouble now. My name is Joseph. Sorry for getting you into this, and thanks. Uh, Charles Reed. I was actually looking for you. For me? How can I help you? What do you know about that thing? The girl that attacked us? She's Usha, a Mayan priestess, rejected by death itself. I can only imagine what baleful sorcery still keeps her alive. Unusual, even by this mad city's standards. Why would a Mayan priestess come here? What's special about this house? It was me she was after. Usha holds a secret older than humanity itself, and she wants to stop me from uncovering it. Don't ask me about it further. I can't say any more. I need your help to get into Katiganar. This madness must be stopped. Oh, that's a noble goal, but Vanderberg... Johannes was the one who told me about you, and about all the things that have happened since the Flood. He did? Well, I underestimated you. We share the same goal, but there's a problem. What kind of problem? The Mayan girl, Usha. She was the keeper of the key to Katiganar. We'll need it. You mean the seal? I have it. Just show me the entrance. The seal. You've got it. Spectacular. Uh, but alas, it, it doesn't solve our problem. You're testing my patience, Joseph. Usha was the last one to open the path below, and she still protects it. We cannot proceed until she's been dealt with. I'm a private eye. Tracking Usha won't be a problem. But how do we handle her? Look, when you locate her lair, come let me know. Meanwhile, I'll prepare our defense against her magics. Then together, we'll banish her. My bullets did nothing. Do you know of any other ways to fight her? There are ways to resist her sorcery. I was going to use them myself, but I'm not sure I have the skills to track this thing to her lair. But didn't she come to you? She caught me off guard, tried to kill me. I was unprepared. You arrived just in time to scare her off. Any leads on how to track her? I don't know. But she drinks blood to gain strength. There must be victims, corpses, but... Thanks to the wild beasts and madness, Oakmont is full of the dead. Uh, though, I did hear rumor of a vampire in Salvation Harbor. Well, I guess that's better than nothing. Johannes told me nothing about you. Can you fill me in before we continue? I understand. You're curious. Your face tattoos are rather... unusual. What do they mean? The Indians gave them to me. I visited a lost pyramid in the jungle. These are marks of wisdom. Your illness. How did you get it? Is it contagious? As with many of the tropical maladies, it was born by a certain species of fly. They bred in the wells of the old Mayan temple. Superstitious savages may call it a curse of the gods, but 
We're people of culture, aren't we? I've seen enough to not take superstition so lightly these days. If Johannes trusts you enough to recommend your help, you must have some unique expertise. Well, I am an archaeologist, well versed in alchemy and other less academic sciences. I have devoted my life to stopping the end of the world. Wait, what? I spent years in the jungle learning from Mayan descendants. The illness forced my return, but I believe Shibalba's entrance is under Oakmont. You want to get into this place, under Oakmont? No, no! That place must be closed forever! All that befalls Oakmont has emerged from within its walls. Well, I agree with that. Did you say... Shibalba? The world of the dead. It brings disasters, epidemics, madness. The most violent Mayan guards were locked inside and need sacrifices to remain. Different locals gave it different names. Some of them can be traced, their origins identified. But Katigana, it precedes us all. And that's plenty. Thanks, Joseph.
fish. These guys were going to have a good meal here. She didn't spill a single drop of blood. All his blood was drained, just like Joseph said. He didn't die immediately. These are some savage bites to the neck. He would have suffered. Yeah, nothing useful inside. Old clothes and garbage, but this letter may be helpful. this shotgun blast, they would have lost their head. Great fisk, buddy. Hope none of those hungry warm skins saw you here.
นเกีบนายฟ้าเอ็ดเลนบนกอดเดดสดาราเนลนดเบเรียมันสอฟาร์ฟอริออร์ซิกรลิชอเดมีพรีสเตสและฉันจะเสิร์ฟโอเคไปดูว่าเราจะมีอะไรที่นี่ครับผมหวังว่าพวกเขาไม่ได้ยินเสียงที่ดีๆที่เราได้ยินอุชาแทกทรีอินส์มาเธอร์สบีฟอร์แมนอัพเฮียร์ดและทรายด์ดูชูดเธอร์เขาเรียกเธอว่าเรย์มันด์และฮิปนาทิซ์เธอร์เขาซัมฮาวเชื่อว่าชายหนุ่มชื่อแรมมอนด์อยู่ที่นี่เขาจะอยู่ที่นี่ฉันต้องไปคุยกับเขาคุณจะดีกว่าจะคุยกับเขาแรมมอนด์อาร์เจอร์ไม่อยู่ที่นี่เขาเสียไปหลายวันแล้วไม่กลับมาไม่พักเลยแต่ไม่ได้ไม่ได้ไม่ได้ไม่ได้ไม่ได้ไม่ได้ไม่ได้ไม่ได้ไม่ได้ไม่ได้ไม่ได้ไม่ได้ไม่ได้ไม่ได้ไม่ได้ไม่ได้ไม่ได้ไม่ได้ไม่ได้ไม่ได้ไม่ได้ไม่ได้ไม่ได้ไม่ได้ไม่ได้ไม่ได้ไม่ได้ไม่ได้ไม่ได้ไม่ได้ I found a debt letter from you at a crime scene. Can you tell me who it was for? <laughs> I have no idea. Why? Do you send that many of them? Yes, thanks to all you damn newcomers flooding Oakmont. I have a form letter that I adapt. Well, make a newcomer adapt for me to pay his debt. Got 50 of them back here right now. Clever, eh? Indeed. Less useful than I'd hoped, though. Yeah, see you later. Did Raymond get this air tank from the same place I did? Huh. 
I've seen some of these places. The backyard with corpses. Joseph Hill's house. Why did he draw all this? Stop it! Please, stop it! Why do you show me this vile violence? I can't bear it!
Someone wounded really wanted to get inside this room. These tools were used for surgery. This lab, it has nothing to do with normal science. She won't tell you about the Tiganar or God. She won't talk to you. Only the seed may know. Looks like it contains ashes mixed with salt. I do not want to know its origin. Promised we'd be rich, Hill. Go ask her about gold. Not that nonsense about Kathy Damhar or seals. Help me, you bastard! Stop this monstrosity! Let me in! You 
broke the ceiling, sir. Time to figure this out. Promised we'd be rich, Hill. Go ask her about gold. Not that nonsense about Kathy Damhar or seals. Damn, you broke the ceiling circles. Let me in! Joseph Hill and Raymond tortured Usha to find out how to get inside Katiganar. But she got free and attacked them. Hill fled, leaving Raymond alone with her. Stop! She has something to say. Raymond? I was looking for you. We have to talk about the undead Mayan. You don't need to hurt her. She knows what you want. She can offer a deal. Last I heard, you were trying to shoot Usha. But now you're her messenger. Why the about face? She took this body as her vessel. She doesn't want to frighten you. Well, using a man as a puppet is still creepy, Usha. What deal are you talking about? You, Chosen, must descend into the depths, into the shell. She knows the way. I need to enter to stop the madness. If you tell me how to do it, I won't pursue you. Generous. She has another offer. Help her. And she will tell you how to meet your destiny. And what exactly am I supposed to do? Kill Sorcerer. Joseph. He does not let her rest. He will pursue and enslave her once again. You could have just told Joseph what he wanted. What difference would it have made? The Sorcerer does not deserve these gifts. He is guided by pride and greed. She waited for the K Chosen to appear, and here you are. Marked, tied up by fate. She sees it in your eyes, wide shut. Why should I kill Joseph? And why do you keep calling him a sorcerer? He woke her up, plundered her body, forced her to breathe once more, cut her, pierced her, Burned her. Kept her in chains. You want revenge. She wants freedom. No freedom while the sorcerer lives. What will you do after you're free? Live. If I do what you ask, where will we meet? Among the stone fingers in the Garden of the Dead. Oh, can't you just tell it straight? I've had enough riddles for a lifetime. She believes your mind is not that weak. After everything I've seen in this laboratory, I'm on your side. She will wait for you.
still have no idea how to fight Usha. I might be losing my mind, but I'm not crazy enough to go in unprepared. I still have no idea how to fight Usha. I might be losing my mind, but I'm not crazy enough to go in unprepared. I need an explanation, Joseph. No? Uh, what did you want to know? I found the laboratory, Joseph. The one used to raise dead from the ashes and salt. So then you understand why I need Usha's body. She knows what we both need. The way inside Kotiganar. You revived the dead, then tortured them. 
That's an abomination. Do not rush to judgment, Reed. They had their time. Would you truly value one old life over the suffering of millions? They're not even human. Those specters, monstrosities, they are just the vessels of their former knowledge. You can't compare them to the living. You tormented Usha to get the knowledge you were after. Why? She refused to tell me what I needed. I was trying to find another way, but until the spell was found, I used more mundane methods. Like pouring acid on her? It was stubborn. No longer human. I was forced to try everything. Every time I recreated her, she told me I didn't deserve the knowledge. I know you had a deal with Raymond, the man who brought you the mummy. What happened to him? Nothing he didn't deserve. This newcomer, he was only interested in treasure. It's his fault who is after us now. He's her toy now, possessed and tormented. But it was you who let this happen. Me? I did not free her. And for Kay's sake, why should I risk everything to save an imbecile? My mission is of far greater importance. Usha made me a proposal. She's willing to help me get inside Katiganor. What? Surely not. It must be a trap. You didn't even ask me what she wanted in return. I fear I know already. She wants me dead. Dane, she's using you, Reed! She knows I'm the only one who can stop her! I have already prepared the Ungwent to prevent her resurrection. Please, can't we just finish this as planned? Now calm down, Joseph. I'm not fool enough to believe a blood-sucking monster. Just thought you ought to know. Okay. Oh, you scared me for a moment. But if we're finished here, you should probably continue your search. I know where Usha is. It's the same crypt that Raymond was diving in. So, she returned to the tomb. Fine, we'll strike now. Prepare your guns. What's the plan? I've formulated an elixir that should damage her unnatural body. Coat your bullets in it, and go and slay the monstrosity. Just don't forget to collect her ashes afterwards. I'll prepare everything we need and wait nearby. Soon we'll both have our answers.
visitor was sunken too. He was one of the lucky ones. of seaweed on it. She forbids you to go further. The sorcerer still lives. I came to put an end to you, undead abomination. Then you will suffer. This will be your doom now.
I need an explanation, Joseph. No? Uh, what did you want to know? I found the laboratory, Joseph. So then- You revived- Do not- Those- I know you had a- Nothing- These are to- You tormented- She- Like pouring a- It was- Usha made me a- What? You didn't even ask- I f I have already- Sorry, Joseph. I don't want to deal with either of you. But Usha is the one who knows what I need. Not you. Nothing personal. You're dooming us all. I won't let you do this. Ah! You did well. She is pleased. Enter her home and she will tell you the secret of the depths. Where will I find you? Didn't she tell you? About the stone fingers in the garden where the dead men live on? She thought you'd understand. Ah, oh, can't you be more specific? A garden for the dead... It is that a cemetery or crypt? See? You did have it. Seems like a lot of running around when we're already talking. The vessel through which she talks would hear what he does not deserve. She would prefer not to kill him. Okay then. I'm on my way.
Joseph is dead. I fulfilled my part of the deal. Now it's your turn. What smart man? Ask and she will answer. Stop the cycle like the cab before you. Like the ancestors. What lies beneath this city? Tell me about the ruins. A temple. A prison. A cradle of old gay. A dark pit speaking with many voices. She never knew. Only a name. Ktikonar. How do you know this? She asked the dead. The dead who came before. And they asked their dead like you ask her now. This is the cycle. Tell me how I can enter the temple. You must find a sacred seal. The key to the monoliths. You and it know each other. It will obey. You mean this one? Yes, yes, fate is kind. Now listen well. You have seen the great stone in the city center? This is the gate to Shivalba. How do I open the gate in the monolith? You must search for a hollow, craving to accept the seal. And that's it? No. The seal is incomplete. You must gather three gay fingers growing on the three monoliths, and unite them with the seal. So I've got to find pieces of three monoliths. Can you at least tell me where they are? She doesn't know. But every cycle the fire servants gather near these special places. Find them. They will have the answer. How can I stop the madness that seeps from below? What waits for me down there? You will find out when it is time. Her marked man descended, and the Katiganar slept. Follow his path. Do as he did. And did he return? No. 
You say there were others before me. Who were they? Marked men and women and things that went before. This place is old, but it still stands. Why do you call me Marked? You bear the touch of old Kay. You see more, feel more, and are even more inside. I just need to find the fire worshippers, then gather the three K fingers to complete the seal. I suppose it could be worse. She wishes you the wisdom to choose what must be chosen. But leave now. She must rest. Farewell. I don't know if it's possible, but... I hope you can find some good in your new life. Oh, she will enjoy it. But must change before leaving this place. Ugh! <laughs>